And charges have been dropped against a woman and her 14-year-old son accused of a revenge killing at a Southside hot dog stand. You can't even eat your glizzy in peace, B. It's Spurs Davis on the check-in. As y'all may know, there's been a video surfacing online of a man that put his hands on a woman. You know, the woman just happened to have her 14-year-old son there. You know, if y'all haven't seen it, the video, you can probably find it on Facebook. You know, YouTube's not really allowing us to post footage like that. You know, they'll take it down in a heartbeat. Trust me, I done had a few videos taken down. Two in particular, I can't really show violence. But anyway, uh, Nicki Minaj, you know, she stepped in and made her post on Instagram, basically calling the young boy a hero because the woman that had her son with him, you know, the son ended up dumping the whole clip and Buddy, and, you know, Buddy passed away. And, you know, the irony when he said, you know, he's going to put hands on her and he put it on his grandma, you know, the internet went crazy and, you know, now he's up there with his grandma and all that. But yeah, Nicki Minaj, he pretty much saluted the young boy. I mean, he is a hero. I think a lot of us was rooting for this, you know, rooting for things to go this way. Because a lot of us didn't think that, you know, the charges would be dropped. Because from my understanding, Illinois is in a stand your ground state. So, you know, as I said, in the worst between the mother and the son. But hey, look, God was on their side. And, you know, everything worked itself out. But you know, this ain't the first time Nicki Minaj has offered to pay in, uh, tuition for somebody. You know, she's done it on Twitter in the past. And I know they low key saw they like, yo, we don't want no college tuition. We want some money, you hear me? You know, but uh, hopefully, you know, this works out. You know, she sticks to her word and hopefully, you know, they do put this boy in college because, you know, Chicago's not one of the best cities in the world and, you know, it can easily swallow you up if you don't get out of it. So, you know, this is a dope thing. Maybe Nikki would do more for the family. I think that'd be dope because, you know, I'm sure this is traumatizing for the little boy. And, you know, let's not uh, forget about the family of, you know, the deceased man. I mean, he had two children too. I saw pictures with him with his daughters. And, you know, I just think that's unfortunate. But at the same time, we don't really know the backstory. We don't really know what happened, you know, behind the scenes of what caused the argument. We, you know, we'll never know his side for obvious reasons, but I'm sure it'll come out in due time. But let me know how y'all feel about it in the comments. Y'all think more people need to come forward, help out, etc. And of course, if you like the video, make sure you like and subscribe.